What's up, everybody? Lash Off Hockey Ninja here. It is time for episode 4 of my New York Rangers franchise mode series in NHL 21. So, the Tampa Bay Lightning have won the Stanley Cup. They went back to back. Rochester Americans won it in the AHL. The New York Islanders have won the draft lottery. Ottawa goes from 12 to 2. Los Angeles via Calgary gets 3, and Los Angeles also gets number 4. So, interesting. We had a disappointing first round exit, unfortunately. But I'm going to be doing the draft in this episode. Let's view retired players. Let's see if any big names. Patrick Marlowe, that is a very big name. He ended up on Vancouver, must have gotten traded there. 1,800 games played to break Gordy Howe's all-time NHL games played record. Trevor Daly, Brad Richardson down there. Let's see if any goalies. Obviously, I'm not expecting a whole lot the first year. Coach retirement, I'm not going to check. Hopefully none of them are mine. Gar Marion Gaberick is now a scout. Not going to do draft interviews. Alright, the draft. So what I did in the first episode is I did not assign scouts because it makes it easy. So I've got no idea how much we know. Let's see where my pick is. I've got pick... Twenty-five, so that's not great. Not great. I'm just gonna sim to it. I'm not gonna trade for one of the top picks. I feel like that's pretty unrealistic. I'll check who went first overall and all that stuff in a minute. And we know nothing. Do they not know? Oh, this is gonna be really hard to build the team without assigning the scouts. They don't know anyone. I only know a few of the top prospects, so. Do they know any gems? Uh, no, they don't. Do they know any potentials at all? Not really. I guess this guy's... No, he's real. He's, I've never heard of him, so... Okay, this is a blind draft. This is a blind draft. I'm still gonna use the pick. Hopefully I can get medium top 6, medium top 4. So Ratsy went first, highly 70. Only a 70 overall is pretty low for a first overall pick, but high elite. Of course, really good. Ottawa got an 81 medium elite. The Kings did pretty well. High top six, high top six, medium elite. Dylan Gunther, it's a really good pick at seven. Good pick for the Blues. Carson Lambos. So a pretty solid top 10. And a bunch of just basic medium top six, medium top four. I'm just gonna pick and hope. I that's all I can do. I've heard of Riley Kidney, but I don't know. Maybe I'll take Lindgren. We already have one Lindgren. We can have two Lindgrens. I don't really know. I don't really know. Do we there's just nothing on anyone because I didn't assign scouts. I'm feeling Lars Lindgren, let's go. Medium top four sixty four overall, I'll take that. That's about what that pick, pick's value should have. We didn't have a second rounder. Let's see for this third. I'm just gonna be taking people in the area. Josh Lawrence, I've heard of Josh Lawrence. Wasn't he high top six last year? I'm taking Josh Lawrence, I feel like he was. I don't know that for sure, but low top six is not horrible. It's not horrible, I'll take that. It's going to be so hard to get value through the draft in this franchise mode series. This guy's made up, so he could be really good, but he also could suck. Um, Byron Owen, it's just... Look at this goalie, Nick Malik. I'm feeling the goalie, I'm feeling the goalie. Medium starter, I'll take that. 65 overall is pretty solid too. I'll take that all day. Oh, and we got another pick right here. All right, all right, all right. I'm getting way too lucky so far. Where's my AHL guy? Oh, a fan of Sink. Well, the scouts recommend these guys. So I'm going to trust them. Byron Owen, let's go. Medium top nine. Okay, I shouldn't trust this guy. Like, that's not bad. He's still 60 overall. Medium top nine's okay. But my random picking was doing better. So, Brent Burns. Brady Burns. Jackson Bellamy, I've heard of him too. Shannon Stoll. It's this guy. He's medium elite. He's medium elite. I'm calling it. 
know, meeting tops. Again, that's not horrible. That would have been really scary if I was right. So at least I'm drafting NHL potential players because that's not a guarantee. Oscar Kvist, six foot four, age twenty, hundred eighty-eight pounds. Yeah, I felt like that was gonna be a horrible pick and picked him anyways. A lot of mid-round picks when and when you can't see who they are, it's they're not that valuable. Oliver Suni, Martin Lang, Melvin Apple. There's no way I'm not taking the guy named Melvin. Low top nine. Eh. This draft has been pretty standard. Wyatt Penner, Stu Paco. Ooh, maybe I should take a Finn. Tommy Pentakainen. Welcome to the New York Rangers. Never mind, you're never going to make it. That's too bad for you. Oh, well, what are you going to do? This is not going too well. Oh, this guy could be medium. Okay, I'm taking him. I'm taking him. The scouts actually have a guess. Joseph Millen, medium elite. Medium bottom six, that figures. So, last pick in the draft right here. I'm going to sort by potential again. I guess they did some work about people that may or may not be drafted. Might as well take one of these guys that could be medium elite. Kent Wong. Six foot three. Kent Wong. No, I didn't think so. Alright, so that's the draft. That's all I'm going to do in this episode. Free agency should be next, so hope you enjoyed watching, and please don't forget to like and subscribe.